Hi everybody, this is my granddaughter Kira. Hi. So I wanted to talk to her today about her recent time at Vacation Bible School. She went to two different Bible schools, one in the morning and one in the evening. And I thought I would ask her some questions and she could talk about some things that she learned. So let's talk about your morning Vacation Bible School that you went to. Did you have a good time? Yeah. Well, good. And you talked about... Uh, a lot of things related to the creation of the world, is that right? Mm -hmm. Well, what did you learn here? I know you had several words that you followed to try to learn about the Bible and what God's word has to say about the beginning of things. So what were those key words that you were talking to me about uh, having to do with the making of this world? Uh, creation, corruption, catastrophe, confusion, Christ, and the cross. And what was that last one that you said one more? Consummation. Consummation, okay. Could you tell me a little bit about it? Some people, you know, not everybody reads a Bible. Not everybody believes in God. And that makes us kind of sad sometimes. But what does creation mean for somebody that doesn't know what that word means? What's that mean? Well, creation is something that God made in the, on the very first day that he decided to make the earth. Oh. So he created the light. He oh. created the light, day and the darkness, night. Wow. That's, that's really hard for us to really understand, isn't it? Yeah. What, what was that second word, corruption? Corruption what? is when Adam and Eve ate the fruit out of tree out of the tree of knowledge of good and evil oh well what, was that a good thing or a bad thing that was a horrible thing that god told them th that told them not to do so you're saying they were disobedient they didn't listen to god yeah and that caused all kinds of problems mm -hmm. god told adam that he would have hard time uh like farming and then he told Eve that he would that she would have a lot of pain giving birth to children. Oh, well, that caused all kinds of problems. I guess that leads to your third one, their catastrophe. What's a catastrophe? That's like a really big problem, right? Yeah, catastrophe is when God sent the flood. Oh. He told Abraham, Abraham. You mean Noah you're talking about? Yeah, yeah, Noah. Sorry. <laughs> Noah. And so he told him that that he should build an ark that was a, the size of a basketball field, uh, as as big as three giraffes stacked. And oh, that's really huge. Yeah, and so he told him that in 40 days uh, that he would send a huge flood bigger than Mount Everest that poured that uh that, that brought water down you mean? yeah that brought it down you mean yeah, like rain water. yeah so, everywhere I, yeah it rained wow. down for 40 days and 40 nights so it just flooded everything then everything and well your fourth one was confusion i think right yeah confusion is when god confused all languages that's why all we have now that's why now we have all different kinds of languages oh. because the people uh the people of um wasn't it babel they built some tower or something yeah the tower of babel the the people kept building up to heaven because they wanted to be like god and oh. so uh when God was, he, he became so angry that he, um, he confused all languages around the... So then they couldn't talk to each other, right? Yeah. Wow. Totally confusing. But then you said a lot of time went by, right? And then something about Jesus coming. What's that? What's that? Christ? Was that the word? Yeah, Christ. It's when, it's when God, when... God told an angel to send down to send down to Mary. He told uh, Mary that he would have a son named Jesus. Mm. And so when the time was right, Mary gave birth to Jesus on Christmas Eve. 
Wasn't he just like a regular person, though? No, he wasn't. He was the son of God. He he was perfect. He was perfect. But nobody's perfect, right? Yeah, I know, but that's the thing. God gave God gave Mary the the son of Jesus. Oh. Oh, that's the Mary I've heard about. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then, but he died. It, didn't they kill him? Yeah, but he rose three days. Weren't they mad at him or something? Uh, yeah. They didn't like what he said sometimes. Yeah, they all disagreed that they all disagreed that um that he was he that he was the truly one. He oh, was all truthful. That he, that he was the son of God. You mean? Yeah. He they they all thought that he was lying. Oh. They didn't believe him. Do but do it? Does everybody believe him today? No. Some people do. Some people, yeah. Do you believe him? Of course, yeah. Oh. And he died. How did he die? He died on the cross for our sins on Easter. Oh, awesome. So if we believe in Jesus and he died for us, then we can be Christians? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. Wow. And what's the last one? What, consummation. What's that? What does that mean? Like... He fixed everything or something? Yeah, he fixed everything. He put it all things in order and oh, all that stuff. That's awesome. You learned a lot of stuff then in that first uh, first vacation Bible school. Yeah, what, what, yeah. Was the, what Was the evening one good? Did you like that one too? Yeah, that one was really fun. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. What, what, did, what did you like most about that one? I kind of liked uh, like doing games with God. Like... Mm games that were about God and stuff. Yeah. Like, um... You said something to me earlier about worshiping God, or... Yeah, worshiping God is when, like, when we first get there, we, like, sing, uh, Thanks God. It's a song that we thanks God for all that he done, that he's done. And then we learned about, uh, Jesus is my superstar. It's, superstar. uh... Wow. Yeah, and yeah. That means like he's, uh, I guess, really special. Yeah, he's really special. Is he like a friend or something? Yeah, he's my friend if you want. Yeah, he's a true friend that we can all trust and be thankful for. Uh, so like, if I have like a really bad problem, I can try to talk to him? Yeah, all you got to do Is that praying? Is that what Yeah, we're doing? all you got to do is fold your hands like this. Yeah. Bow your head and close your eyes. And and then what? And then you just talk to God, uh tell him all your worries and he'll soon fix you. Oh. Uh, wow. I learned a lot right there talking to you. Yeah. Thank you. And I hope you y'all you all did too. Oh, well that's great. So you all have a good day and Kira says goodbye, right? Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>